hey you guys what's up welcome welcome back to my channel so in today's video i decided to film a what's in my bag video for you guys so if you're interested in seeing what i keep in my case spade bag just stay tuned oh, and don't forget to like this video comment and subscribe it's free where I keep her so yeah this is the bag it is a Kate Spade New York bag isn't she cute I think she's beautiful I love her so much she's my favorite bag by far she's actually my first um designer type bag I guess you can say my baby designer bag because this ain't even the real stuff but yeah I just really got into um bags and things like that like name brand bags well-known name brand bags or whatever so this is my first baby and yeah i just decided to go with a black bag so she comes with the two straps which is how i prefer to hold her but on those times when i'm busy i use the long strap but yeah Oh, and if I didn't say, I got this online. I ordered it at the, I think the Kate Spade outlet. I'll have everything on the screen. The best thing about this bag is that it was priced at $50, you guys. Only $50. This bag is originally a hundred and something dollars. I'll have that on the screen as well. But I had looked at the right time, I guess, and they happened to be having a sale. And yeah, I got a huge percentage off. So definitely make sure that you guys are looking on these sites or maybe shop at the outlet sites instead and you can get these bags or different bags at a lower price. So yeah, I only got this baby for $50 and I'm so happy. I love being a bargain shopper. Just like I said, I was never into bags. I'm not the type to want to spend $100 on a bag. I'm getting more into it now, I guess, but i'm just glad i got her at 50 dollars. let's just say that so that's why i was like you know what you cannot beat this let me go ahead and purchase this bag so yeah enough rambling now let's get into this bag okay so i'm not gonna be able to hold her up for you guys for real for real but yeah we're just gonna go through it so the first thing in my bag is my keys um i just have a little keychain on it this a keychain one of the parents from my job gave it to me and i guess he had one to barcelona he had got all of me and my co-workers in the room one with our initials on it so of course mine has an a on it and yeah then i just have my little towson tigers um keychain thing towson university Ooh. so yeah that's the first thing in my bag Next is my wallet. I thought it was nice to get a wallet that matched. I wasn't going to get no Kate Spade wallet now because, you know, we save money over here. But Wednesday, we'll have a bag that matches the wallet, whatever. But for now, I just decided to go on Amazon and I found this wallet that matched my bag perfectly. As you can see, it's black and they both have the gold detail on it. So, yeah, this is my wallet. This says the Travel Lambo wallet. I don't know. It was an affordable price on Amazon, so I just went ahead and got it. I was needing a new wallet, and like I said, I wanted one that was small and fit perfectly in my purse. And yeah, it was the same color, so I just keep my cards in here, nothing special. You know, a wallet. I don't got no cash on me, though. I ain't carrying no cash with Corona anyway, so yeah. Uh, let's see. Next, I have my sunglasses in here. These are the sunglasses you probably see me in a lot if you watch my videos. But I believe I got these off of I Buy Direct. Um, yeah, I usually shop for my glasses online. And these ones have prescription in them. 
so yeah I love these just for the simple fact that I am blind and when I feel like being cute when I just want to you know kind of block out the sun because these really don't do that great of a job at blocking out the sun in my opinion they really just help me see more so but when I want to be cute and you know block out the sun a little bit I'll put these on put on my hated blockers you know what I'm saying so yeah that's that love those sunglasses all my other sunglasses, I'm, I just keep them in my car or in my room. But those are the ones that I really need, especially when I'm going to work. I love to have my sunglasses on. So next in my bag is this. I don't have no gum or nothing, but I do have this Biotin Dry Mouth Moisturizing Spray. It's in Gentle Mint. It says soothing moisturization, immediate symptom relief that lasts for up to four hours, helps keep your mouth fresh. So instead of gum, I have this option just in case you need it, even though where you are, you might eat something. Spray, spray, spray. And yeah, fresh breath on the go. Um, so next, I just have this Q tip case. Um, I just been refilling it because. Yeah, I love to have Q-tips. Um, you need to clean out your ears, clean out your nose, whatever. I like to use these for those purposes. Even like cleaning up makeup around your eyes or whatever. Or putting like Vaseline on my lashes. Whatever the case is, Q-tips are great for all of that stuff. So then next I have my Beyonce rise perfume um my dad gifted me with this set and this is like the more smaller travel size version of it i also have the bigger one because he got me that too i never like ran out of it yet so yeah it's the beyonce rise perfume because sometimes i be forgetting to spray perfume on me it don't happen often but sometimes it does so i have that for just in case and then I also have the lotion too, you know. Sometimes you forget your lotion. Sometimes you're in a rush, you're rushing, and you need your lotion. So, yeah, I have the Beyonce Rise set in my bag. You guys, I stuffed this bag to capacity. Then I also have some other mini perfumes. Okay, I did a little much. I really wanted to put a spray in here, but I couldn't fit everything. A body spray, not a perfume spray. But since I already had the perfume spray, I was like, sis, you need to choose one or the other. But yeah, I also decided to put my little mini travel size perfumes in there as well. This is the Daisy Marc Jacobs Dream. And then I also have the Daisy Dream Marc Jacobs perfumes. And they're so cute and so tiny. I've had these for, I don't know, probably a year or more. And I still have them, like, because I just have so many sprays and scents and stuff. But yeah, I just use that one to, like, dab on my forearms and then dab some on my neck. You know, be smelling good or whatever. Let's see what else. I think this is the last thing I have in the middle of my bag. And then we'll be moving into the pockets. And then we'll be done. So, yeah, I just have this elf mirror i just wanted to put a black mirror in my purse um i mean nowadays you can use your phone to check your makeup or your lip gloss or whatever but ain't nothing like having i'm opening it the wrong way ain't nothing like having a mirror in your bag it also has some powders but i think the powders are honestly too light for me anyways but yeah it's a nice mirror you can check your makeup or whatever check your lips this you know I might really want to keep extra makeup on me. And this bag isn't big enough anyway. Anything I need to like touch up my frown lines. But I'll usually just use my hands like that. Or that brings me to this thing that I have in my bag. Oh, it's right here. I just would like to use one of these and just, you know, touch off my frown line area. And make sure like I'm not too thin because. I have frown lines so yeah that's what this will be for even though it's the makeup sponge but i can have the same use so i guess i'll just go into this pocket really quick in this pocket i just have some 
pads. I use nothing other than um, organic pads because that's the way to go. Make sure, ladies, you're taking care of your vaginal health and you're not using no tampons, no um, pads that have all those toxins in them because all the tampons and pads that we used to use back in the day have a lot of chemicals in them and yeah that's why we have a lot of health problems as it is so definitely get one of these brands this is the l brand really thin so if you don't like big pets these are really thin um this one is a long one so it's good and then this is a honey pot one this is a lot shorter this might be one of the scented ones and then like tingles and you like feel the tingly like peppermint scent or whatever scent it is but yeah, definitely get L brand, Honey Pie, or any other of the organic um, pad brands. And I also have some tampons in here. Um, these are also from the L line. So yeah, just keep those on me. So I'm good just in case my time of the month comes and surprises me. Definitely need those. So I also have some nail glue in here i got this off amazon i had got this originally for my hair when i got these done the girl told me i needed it i guess to put these ends on or whatever but i still had some left over which came in handy because these nails i have on right now are press on nails and if you know anything about press on nails they be popping off left and right they look cute or you know or whatever but they do be popping off so Definitely need me some nail glue just in case I'm out with my nails on. Um, and the last thing I have in this pocket is just some contacts because I am blind. I actually have some contacts in right now. Um, yeah, so I can see because I'm either wearing glasses or contacts or I'm blind, but yeah these contacts come in handy these are the one a day so i don't need the case for those are the ones you just throw away okay so i'm moving on to the last pocket you guys i just have my hand sanitizer hand sanitizer is so important corona or not you should always keep a hand sanitizer on you especially like when you go out to a restaurant or something you need some hand sanitizer because are you gonna go in the bathroom and wash your hands on the way from your car from your place to your car no you're not so definitely at least use some hand sanitizer if that's the case um and just after you touch doors and stuff anyways then i just have a little gloss a baby lips gloss i love gloss so yeah that comes in handy i have some more gloss <laughs> i've been losing lip glosses so you can never have too much lip gloss this one is just a Burton and Bees Hydrating Lip Oil Gloss. Oh yeah, I forgot to show some band-aids, you know. You never know. You might need them. They'll probably come in handy. I'm clumsy or you might get a little paper cut. I don't know. You got some kids with you, you know, they might need a band-aid. So it always comes in handy. Um, and then guys, I just have some pens you know you can never you never know if you're gonna need a pen like pens are important so i just keep pens on me when i'm at work i might need a pen i don't want to use the pens everybody else is touching and yeah i just like these because they're actually the, the actual colors of the pens so yeah i just keep these on me at all times and because i keep losing them people keep stealing them so i just keep them on me at all times so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I, ho I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I have in my bag. If you're interested in getting you a bag as well, definitely get you one, sis. You deserve it. Treat yourself sometimes, you know? So yeah, and definitely look for those sales as well. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like this video, comment if you're interested, and subscribe to my channel. It's for you guys. So I'll see you in my next video. Bye.